I promise this story about a road cutting is interesting. This cutting is located at Norman Street in Ballarat, Victoria. Aside from looking truly beautiful, the story it tells is one that is just remarkable. The almost completely vertical lines witnessed here allow us to interpret the fact that this landform was created by a cataclysmic series of events. What you are seeing here are beautiful mudstones and sandstones among other various deep sea sedimentary rocks that were once laid down on a deep ocean floor. This same ocean floor was where this very ground I'm standing on once lay over 550 million years ago. The origin of these rocks were actually eroded from the rivers and sent out west to the sea that lay just west of South Australia. But back then, it'd be known as Gondwana, the supercontinent with Antarctica to its south. These rocks then tell us that a series of tectonic collisions occurred, and these collisions had their origins in multiple locations across Victoria and would occur several times, slowly raising the state up from the deep ocean sea, alongside New South Wales and the vast majority of Queensland. When these types of tectonic collisions occur, these rocks are subjected to vast amounts of pressure. They're literally squashed together, broken, faulted, broken again, refaulted, rinse and repeat. And what you have after multiple series of low-grade metamorphic sequences is this beautiful outcrop that was created like an art piece after a simple road cutting sliced through this once typical looking hillside. It's almost like an artist painted it. The pink, purple and brown colours so beautifully interlaid amongst each other, with hues interspersed within. But what we haven't spoken about is something that, in my opinion, makes this even more beautiful. And that was the mineralisation that occurred to these rocks. With the heaviest events peaking at the end of each tectonic collision that occurred in Victoria, over the course of between 550 million years to 360 million years ago, give or take. These events are what made Victoria the incredibly gold-rich state that it was, and still is. And it was because of these beautiful, tasty fellas. And I love these guys. These quartz reefs and stringers were shot into the faults that were created during subduction events. Tectonic collisions and mountain building events such as what is witnessed here, always come with heavy mineral deposits. These deposits are a result of the metamorphic series of events that occur, where minerals are literally quote unquote sweat out of the rocks as they subduct deeper into the earth, due to the immense heat and pressure that occurs. Water is also released from hydrous minerals, and this creates a boiling mixture that kind of acts like an underground volcano of mineral rich fluids. It's like a magma chamber in a way, because what happens is these fluids accumulate deep within the earth, percolating and building up their pressure until it finally reaches a point where they are able to shoot through a fault by physically opening up the structure and being released, where they would then shoot through until the fluids begin to reach a point where they depressurize and cool, and they solidify as this beautiful gold rich quartz that we have everywhere here in Victoria. So yeah, this road cutting tells a remarkable story in my opinion, and if you're ever in Victoria, you should visit Ballarat, and definitely treat yourself to this site, as it's even more incredible in person. Thanks for watching.